My name is Peter Hollenbeck. I'm a professor of biological sciences at Purdue University and a neuroscientist, and I was a longtime member of the TAA's Scientific Advisory Board. And I have Tourette syndrome. There are a number of areas of both more basic and, and applied research that I saw during my, my years on the Scientific Advisory Board that I think are exciting and, and promising. Probably everyone's aware that we've had a long-term hunt for the genetic basis of Tourette. We keep hearing that that's going to become clearer next year, and we'll see. I think the most exciting thing that developed during my time on the board was the cognitive behavioral therapy for tick, so-called CBIT. And this was basically an application of uh, new ideas about cognitive behavioral therapy, new ideas about ticks and their premonitory urges that were pulled together by a, a group of terrific clinical psychologists um, who got seed money initially from us at the TAA and then went on to do large-scale studies to develop a treatment that really works. It works about as well as meds, but it's not a medicine. It's like learning to ride a bike. You get trained how to manage your ticks. Um, and then you go off and you're empowered to do it. So that's probably the single most interesting piece of clinical science. Um, another thing that was terrific is the development of neuroimaging. So our understanding of what's going on functionally in the brain of people when they tick, uh, I think has a lot of promise for improving our ability to diagnose and treat Tourette. 